very uh, disappointing season. Um, we had talked a little bit the other day when Chris Illich announced that I was going to uh, come back on a two-year contract that uh, certainly the theme going forward is the future. It's uh, rebuild. It's young kids, but young kids put into the lineup when they are uh, ready to play at this level, <clears throat> not before. Certainly, uh, I believe that you need to have some veterans on the hockey club that are good role models. Um, we've got those, and uh, I, think was, I was on the radio here with Matt Shepard uh, a, a week ago or 10 days ago, and we talked, and I said that, uh, you know, if you look at our roster, we have lots of players that have a year or two to go in their contract, so it's an opportunity for um, some of our young players that aren't quite ready to take the necessary time, but certainly there's opportunity uh, on our team <clears throat> going forward. Um, the only other thing I would say, I guess, basically from a coaching standpoint, you guys are going to ask me, uh, I've decided I'm going to bring back Jeff, uh, Jeff Blaschel for another year. Uh, I thought the team played hard till the finish. Uh, I'm hoping that two, three, four young players uh, in our system uh, make the team. He did a good job with the young players in Grand Rapids when he was a the coach there. I thought this year, at the uh, you know you look at the impact of Bertuzzi and, and Lark and, and the development and, and the importance that they had on the team this year they they improved as players so uh, I'm open for questions. Can <clears throat> the yep. overwrite philosophy that the Red Wings have always adopted are, are you still going to try to I know you said they have to earn it 